a beautiful outdoor wedding is taking place. And all of a sudden the camera angle turns from the bride and groom to a giant tornado in the background. Hey Reverend, let's get this thing going, right? Like, yes, I do, yep, let's go. Mm -hmm. We'll marry you. And here they go, they're all just like, oh yeah, look at that. Yep, yep. Yeah, Have they not seen Twister? They need a cow to come and smack the bride in the face. And maybe then they'll think it's an emergency. That lack of urgency leads people to wonder whether this is true romance or totally divorced from reality. Tell it's your mom I'll take it. Because these people did nothing. They just went, like, oh, well. Let's go get cake. <laughs> if I see a tornado, I am getting in my car and driving to the nearest nuclear bunker to fly and close my hat. No marriage should begin with lies and deceit, so we're coming clean. The nerve-wracking nuptials are 100% real. I guess Kansas has a bigger ball than we do. This love story begins in June 2011, when Caitlin Pence meets Kendra Frederick at a rodeo in Colorado. Just right away, we were best friends, I and mean, it felt so natural. It, 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 Four months later, Caleb takes the whirlwind relationship to the next level. He proposes to Kendra in front of their beloved pet bull, Fat Albert. Some people don't think it was very romantic, but <laughs> it, it's definitely us. That's, that's nice. who we are, so it was great. The wedding takes place on May 19, 2012, at Caleb's family farm in Harper County, Kansas. I mean, it was everything I could have possibly dreamed of. It all came together. The couple monitors the weather forecast, which calls for a storm later in the evening. The day of the wedding, it was actually really sunny. The storm warning was supposed to hit at midnight, so we, didn't had, we had no idea that it was about to happen. The outdoor festivities start without a hitch, but just minutes into the ceremony, Caleb sees a funnel start to form. Happy Father, we thank you so much for the gift of marriage. He tried telling me that there was a tornado on the ground, and I was like, no, there's there's not a tornado on the ground. And then I was like, oh my gosh, this is real. <laughs> An EF3 twister with punishing winds more than 136 miles per hour touches down eight miles away. It's getting darker and closer, and we're like, okay, we really need to hurry up and <laughs> get this wedding going. Near the wedding ceremony, this storm chaser footage captures the raw power of the monster tornado. It's crossing right ahead of us, right ahead of us. Back at the farm, the couple exchanges vows. Kendra starts to get nervous. I was like, we need to go to safety because I really don't want to die. <laughs> but Caleb, a lifelong resident of Tornado Alley, tries to calm his new bride's nerves. He's confident the twister is moving away from the wedding party. I was more scared of saying I do than I was of the tornado because that's, that is scary, flat out scary. Tornadoes, you know, they're gonna be gone in 15 minutes. And she's gonna be here for the next 60 years. Yep. <laughs> With the ceremony over, the newlyweds have the photo shoot of a lifetime. It's a day of highs and lows. Even though there are no deaths or injuries, the tornado destroys multiple homes in the area. And it actually, sadly enough, did destroy our neighbor's farm. So it did a lot of damage. Caleb's uncle posts the unusual wedding video on the internet. Hundreds of thousands of online guests are blown away by what they see. I think this tornado video went viral because people are fascinated by the crazy things that happen in nature in everyday life. And this is the perfect dichotomy of that, you know, beautiful wedding, crazy terrifying tornado, and then they both coexisted somehow. For Caleb, tying the knot with a twister is the perfect wedding day in Kansas. Cowboy hat, the cowboy shirt, the wheat in the background, and tornadoes. And that sums up Kansas in all one picture.